welcome back people before I go into the meat and vegetables about product articles which is what this video is all about I just want to quickly remind you about the benefits of writing articles for a stock you know not only you should know that you know you can make a lot of money from writing articles I and mean, then practice makes perfect but all the while SEO search engine optimization and original content matters in website design uh, then you know these these sort of information products will always be sought after materials I mean Google loves original content we all know that you know they just absolutely love it and so of course you know people are always going to be wanting this kind of this kind of product not everyone can write and you've got to understand if you if you're any anywhere near any good at writing then I really highly suggest that you do actually you know work get some more practice and and and, and do this you know um, people uh, anyone in the marketing field you know if they're doing affiliate marketing they've got products to promote you know they need some written material on that because they've got to send that material to blogs forums and e-zines or wherever else it is to uh, attract traffic because it's a uh, unique and most powerful way of getting traffic to your website to your to your services to your products to your links to everything you know it's like wow an all-round sound flipping terrific thing to have these sort of information products so as I say you know if you can get good at it great you could even start your own e-business your own home business online you know home based business online to actually offer your offer your written work to to people who need it there's plenty of people crawling you know clawing away at trying to get people to, to write materials because they're not all that brilliant at it so um, people will always be be wanting these these uh, this material for, for their for their uh, affiliate uh, products etc etc right now let's get back down to the meat and vegetables now uh, several year, months ago I was approached by someone to write something about a rice making model um, an electrical kind of kitchen uh, unit thing and he wanted me to write some um, uh, an art, uh, some articles on it so uh, what I, I, I wrote an article first of all and gave it away for nothing which is the one we're going to be talking about now so he gave me the, the, the model of uh, several model names and so where do you go what do you do from there well you've got to find some interest in materials you've got to know about it you've got to be able to know something about it be able to write anything about it so what I did is I went to Amazon I didn't do the um, UK one because they didn't have the particular model I went to the American one and of course I thought oh well this is interesting it's got 300 and at that time I think with 330 uh, or, so, or so reviews or 350 reviews now it's 381 so it's going up in the world so there I thought well first things first I opened up a word document so I can take notes you know the quickest way of taking notes not to read but has to copy and paste so I thought well okay well let's have um, the product descriptions and wherever I found any information I just kept popping into a word document so there you know and I just changed it to go along and what else did I do well then I thought well the best place to get some information it will be in the reviews so I came up near the stars there and I clicked onto that and you can get these reviews from anywhere you don't have to just go to Amazon of course but you know Amazon okay great place if it's in there have a good old look in there because okay so how they've set it out here is uh, five star reviews versus the three star the, the lowest um, reviews and I read all that and I, I read it all and I read through all these reviews and I did I read a hell of a lot and I thought and I just took from it all those reviews that had something some content in there that, that told me something about the model I wouldn't have known if I hadn't read it of course and then I went back to my my little old note taking word document and I copy pasted only those reviews that I felt that had something to say and took a few notes here and there but further to that then I opened up another document you could always do yours in one if you like but but you know I do it to, um, because it was heavy and hard work of course because you have to read a lot and of course you know I'm adding I'm adding to these things and I'm rewriting things out so they're all original content there wouldn't be free words they're the same in anywhere else not even on the promotional sites and then I'm kind of slowly grafting out a few uh, um, a, a few of my paragraphs 
and of course I'm reducing down all those reviews that I've got and I'm taking from them gleaning from them and highlighting notes that I felt were interesting for example you know the different things that this thing can cook because if you don't read these things no one's gonna know and no one's gonna know that unless they're prepared to read hundreds of review, reviews to find out and this is where that article comes in squeeze it all down so it's all interesting you know stuff for the, the readers and that's what they want to hear so literally you know I had to go for a hell of a lot of material here to, to you know to work out all well, what's important what isn't and I'm learning things about the design that things that people don't like and things that they do like and things they love and what they don't you get a kind of feel for it you know and I've worked out that that, that review site in Amazon was turning out to be some kind of like forum it was like a, a real private forum with all these cooking elites were swapping recipes and and ganging up well not ganging up but there's there's those that love it to those that not that don't love it so much kind of versus each other and it really is like that it was like a, an own little review so I thought well that's an interesting thing to write about people find that interesting so in the end I came up I came up with my my article and of course here here is the feet that you know the product features and they're not important to have there at the top this is for the the guy wants me to write he can delete that and put it at the bottom or not even have it at all it's just something that is still original content but it's all there you know and it mentions things that not even Amazon mentioned because obviously I went to the actual model site itself also to get information the most important thing here or several most important things about article writing is obviously the introduction you've got to get those people you know reading and wanting to read further into the next what the, the next paragraph and so each paragraph's got to be standalone each paragraph you know okay you shouldn't need to worry about SEO uh, keywords and things they should naturally flow out but I did make a point of doing some keyword research so I've got like loads of different several things about you know rice maker etc etc that will class as keywords and which I did at the end really and pop them in where I could change sort of things anyway back to the thing I'm going to refer this to this model as the NS model so the NS neuro fuzzy rice cooker boasts of delivering restaurant quality uh, perfect rice with its advanced neuro fuzzy logic technology I just kind of like that neuro fuzzy thing it sounds good and funny but also I'm reminding them here about you know professionalism of it because they need to know that it's a good model and um, the NS has the ability to cook uh, different rice types as follows brown semi brown mixed rice and uh, uh, sushi sweets you know rinse for I'm you know so I wouldn't know that none of them would know that unless they read the reviews so I popped that in there and I can come further to that because I separate some others there there is hundreds of five-star customers feedback rating um, rating this model is really impressive okay excellent um, excellent reviews they need to know that and Amazon for example indicates that you know there's several hundred customers that, that rate this model um, with five stars and 45 rated as four stars you know out of the total 352 so and of the few that um, had reviews that were lower than that four stars you know I'm saying here they commended it wholeheartedly so that's an important thing to pop in there yeah I would say so that's what people want to know they want to know whether or not they're going to buy the model or what so I, I continued on you know that this huge commercial rice cooker sells with this immensely power right so what I'm saying here is, is because the fact that there's hundreds of models here you know well in excess of the 300s or whatever you know Amazon aren't indicating that that's the only sales they had because not everyone sends reviews when they buy so there'd be thousands there must be there must be one big wicked seller that because you know we have to have that many in here so that's important I'm gonna mention that remind them about that okay and uh, and I'm also mentioning in this third this third paragraph you know that it's like a typical social media forum with its ever-growing response and updated threads which is exactly what it's like and you know I'm saying it clearly this amazing electric rice cooker compels rice cooking enthusiasts to write reviews with elaborate rice based re uh, recipe ideas you know I'm trying to make this interesting and 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 that's the way to do it it's a standalone standalone lone paragraph with you know it's all got plenty of keywords in it it's so different it doesn't sound spammy or anything now the rice cooker uh, now the rice cooker company uh, I'm referring to them could now include the following in their list of foodstuffs you know and rice cooking types that work well with the model which they don't actually advertise themselves and they wouldn't know uh, unless they read the reviews so grain soups Thai flavored rice um, rose pre-washed rice you know and I couldn't find all these in I couldn't find all these different rices unless I read the reviews myself okay 
and then I continue you know anyone could learn th this company could learn from the rice cooker reviews in respect of the detailed feedback that are given back about you know general po um, uh, about the uh, the cooking abilities and the design and the little flaws that they find you know which aren't all that um, terrible but you know like for example the running cost relates to the soldered Panasonic lithium battery which needs replacing every four to five years that cannot be achieved by by doing it yourself and it costs around twenty seven dollars the reader would be interested in that they're not going to find this information unless they read through like I had and people put it on the plate for them you know and now I'm mentioning more about uh, things about the design not overcooking it off like for example it says it's a five a five cup model but you know which are in fact six ounces therefore those in America that might be misled in thinking that five is the standard US USA which are 40 ounces then that's something else worth mentioning to that to that uh, market of uh, readership yeah okay so and then at the end of it all I'm saying I'm finishing it off which is important as, as a start as you finish so therefore you know this is great loyal divide between those who buy into this model right that, that write good reviews at about five five stars or four stars and those that write clearly that write lower stars and there's this kind of them versus them you know those high stars versus them and and what I'm saying here is that those with high stars even leave a message for those that, that, that write lower stars and that is this read the instructions manual before using the appliances and that's sweet I think that's interesting and I think it did the job and the guy loved it